Good morning! I feel so much. I, it's like, I don't even feel sick anymore. I don't have a headache. But my poor husband, it's like I basically passed the stomach flu onto him. Now, roles are reversed and I'm going to be the one taking care of him. Um, but luckily, we have, we still have our little care package here. Luckily, the C band comes with two. I think it worked for me. Here you go, honey bear. Oh snap, I did it wrong. It says it should be a one hand each to be effective. Can't believe how fast, how fast he caught the flu. He just started vomiting. Um, like around two in the morning, <laughs> instant diarrhea, and it's crazy. So I'm down here going to get him water, and at least we know the drill. Good morning, sweetie bear. <laughs> That's her favorite toy, or her favorite friend in the crib. <coughs> How about twinkle, twinkle, little star? How I wonder what you are Up above the world so high Like a diamond in the sky Twinkle, twinkle, little star How I wonder what you are Yeah that's twinkle twinkle Juliana Yay! I just called my mom to see how she's doing cuz um, yesterday when I went there to pick up Juliana she wasn't really feeling well Benji's sick and yeah, you know, I don't want to risk Juliana getting sick because you know I I just got done and I don't know if I'm still sick or my symptoms are just a lot better and I, and if I'm still contagious, I don't know. So I called mom to see if I could bring her there, but it seems like even my dad has a stomach flu and like all the symptoms that, that Penji has. So I'm just going to keep Juliana home, but be extra, extra cautious. Um, yeah, I'm not going to be kissing her and washing my hands every single time. I hope and pray this little one doesn't get sick. So yeah, it seems like there's a stomach flu going around. So I'm about to have my lunch and I'm eating by myself. Having a ham and cheese and lettuce sandwich and I have a few Juanita chips. I have some water. It's a quiet house. Both baby bears are sleeping. I think I'm actually gonna film my pregnancy update because Last year, when I did Juliana's, I did it every other week, and so today I'm 14 weeks. Uh, that's the sound I've been making all day. I've never felt this bad before. My my uh, body doesn't get sick very often, um, and definitely I've never puked since I was a little kid. But it's weird. I don't even know what to expect. We think that I caught it from Judy because I was helping her out touching you know like her her body i was kissing her and then when she would vomit i would you know ex exchange the um the trash bin and maybe i touched the wrong thing oh man but uh finally knock on wood here i haven't uh, vomited since i want to say like 11 11 30 and I believe it's like almost two, so I'm hoping that stays the same. Thanks for all the nice comments on the Instagram and the Twitter. Which my Instagram's Benjamin Feared, my Twitter's Benjamin TV, because someone stole my Benjamin TV name on Instagram. I'm gonna go on a walk, see if I can get some fresh air. It's been an hour and Juliana's still asleep, but she'll be waking up any minute now, so I'm just gonna prepare her lunch. Usually for lunch, I give her rice with like a meat or some kind of protein, but I don't know what we have yet. 
So I'm wearing my new lipstick again from Urban, I was gonna say Urban Outfitters, <laughs> from Urban Decay. And the color is called Jilted. And you know, I like the lipstick colors. They're not necessarily like long lasting in the sense that if you eat or drink, like it doesn't wear off. It's still a really good lipstick. So I was gonna feed Juliana the meat from the um, soup yesterday, but it looks like Benji ate all of it. Oh, hi there. <laughs> Are you playing? How about your nap, baby? Yeah, mommy. <laughs> Man, this girl, she is so, so mischievous. Oh, she's saying hi. It's not recording. Oops. Uh oh, we just um, finished recording our, our update video. Let's see if the audio is on track. Oh, good. The audio no. is good. Oh yeah, I called this birthing center because um, after having Juliana, I said, you know what? For my second child, I'd want to do like a water birth or have it with a midwife and I don't know like, like now knowing that we're having twins that kind of scares me kind of keep you my distance because I cooked up eggs and the smell of egg is so nauseating oh Ugh. makes me want to puke again sorry baby uh, here daddy is that daddy? <laughs> Don't touch anything. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Poor baby. <laughs> oh yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Don't worry, honey. Hopefully, it'll just last the day. Juliana and I are taking daddy out for a walk. We just needed some fresh air. Poor daddy, huh? I know. <laughs> Eat your apple, baby. <laughs> daddy, how are the apples? Poor baby could barely eat even a slice of an apple. It's so good. It's the first fruit I've eaten in a, about like 16, 18 hours, and it's really good. Isn't it good? Thank you, Yana. <laughs> for doing. Hope you feel better, daddy. I removed the skin for you, did you notice? Really good. <laughs> okay. Get better, Daddy. Okay, so Julian is down for her second nap, and I'm actually gonna nap because I am exhausted. So, Benji's feeling. He's feeling better. I mean, he hasn't thrown up the past few hours and I think getting some fresh air helped, but he hasn't eaten anything, like just strictly water and all that he has had was water with lemon and then like he had like really tiny slices of apple, but that's it. He doesn't even want any broth or anything. But then again, I think he's like traumatized from the beef broth because that's all he was vomiting last night and our whole like room and bathroom smell like it. It was so gross. The nap was so great. Juliana and I both napped for two hours. I checked on Benji and he just woke up from a nap too. Let's see if he wants jello or even oatmeal. You give him a call where Juliana and I are about to have dinner. She's starting off with some tomatoes and we're gonna have curry. Okay, I just went upstairs and he was in his office <laughs> laying down in the bed. But I'm glad he's just out of the room at least. That's progress. And uh, yeah, he hasn't he hasn't vomited since earlier. How are those tomatoes coming along, BB? Dinner is almost ready. I'm still feeling really gross after smelling that egg. 
What's up with the smell of egg? That just makes me nauseous. Did any of you other women that are pregnant and like couldn't stand the smell of it? Daddy coming down? I hear him coming down the stairs. <laughs> Where's daddy? <laughs> this is like our Tokyo days. <laughs> Did you wash your hands, baby? Hi, daddy. And she's like, who the heck is this? Doing okay, daddy? Uh, maybe a nice hot bath will do you right. Or shower. Netflix. Yeah, Netflix. I wish we had Epsom salt. You're such a diva. <laughs> okay, so we have all these bananas and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna make banana bread because I haven't been eating oatmeal lately. Banana bread is probably one of the easiest things to bake because it's so simple and you just use the most basic ingredients. So we had everything in the house. Luckily I didn't have to go to the store, but I'll show you real quick. So first I'm just gonna mash up four bananas, a third of a cup of melted butter, three fourths a cup of sugar, an egg, a teaspoon of vanilla, a pinch of salt, a teaspoon of baking soda. <laughs> Give it a nice mix. And then lastly, one and a half cups of flour. Then you transfer it into a Pyrex. I usually like to add walnuts, but we don't have any walnuts. So we're just gonna go plain. Put your oven, your oven should be heated at 350 degrees. And then that just bakes for an hour. Uh, hey, what happened? Oh yeah, you like that, huh? From Auntie Sonia and Uncle Sean. Your blocks. <laughs> We're watching Glee. Look at this. I think it's halfway into the premiere. Uh, cause we were watching Mulan. But I wonder if Finn is in this season. Or actually I think, is it Finn, his name? But um, I think he recorded a few episodes of the new season before he passed. <laughs> My stomach looks extra bloated today. Alarm is going off. <sighs> oh, it smells really good. I'm just gonna let this cool. So on Friday, September 27th, it's my cousin's birthday, Kate. So please go over to their channel. The channel is 604 Sisters. Yeah, so happy birthday, cousin. We are supposed to go there. Actually, go to Vancouver today, but because of the flu, you know, that didn't work out. And we're gonna keep it easy the next few days. If you could greet my cousin Kate a happy birthday, that'd be really sweet. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear Nina Kate. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. And many more. More. <laughs> And many more. <laughs> more. This right here is seriously the greatest medicine of all. <laughs> here. Here. <laughs> Was a fallen dad, a dog, and bingo. Oh, is that the worm? Sideways worm? B I N G O. B I N G O. And bingo was his name. Oh.